Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and uh, this is a quick uh, look at an app that a lot of you have been asking me what this app is all about and it is in my taskbar at the bottom and uh, many have said what's that little blue icon that seems to look like a smartphone. It is the Your Phone app from um, Microsoft. It is an app that is included in Windows 10 and that has several updates. It's actually a great app that I use all the time. Uh, here you see it is linked to my Galaxy S25 G phone. And this is a app where you have pretty much uh, almost full access to your phone's uh, pictures and messages. You, make, you can even make and receive calls through your PC. What is the main issue for most people right now is the fact that this app works mainly with Galaxy, Samsung Galaxy phones. And that is something that a lot of people find sad because there's a lot of things they can't do if they're not uh, in Samsung phones. But still, a lot of the phones that have Android can still use some of the functionality. So you can get notifications from apps. You can get, uh, you know, uh, messages that are uh, text messages. You can even reply to text messages on your phone, so which is nice because uh, I don't know how many times I did this. I got a text message from someone. I reply it on my PC rather than picking up my phone. It's really, really cool. Of course, you have access to your pictures, which is a lot of fun too. You can, um, uh, you know, save them to their com your computer. You can even uh, right-click a picture and uh, delete it and it will delete it from your phone also which is kind of nice uh, of course access to your apps you can actually have your apps work and this is kind of cool because you can even uh, play in some cases with the apps here and make calls of course and that is definitely a nice thing also so your phone app has really evolved over the last uh, couple of years. It's one of the apps that probably has the most changes and the most new features of all. And it, it definitely is a worth, worth app to actually get. Uh, the way it works, of course, is that you can, if you don't see on your computer, you can actually go to the Microsoft Store and make sure that you download your phone app. That also means that on Android, on your phone, you'll have to add a phone companion app from Microsoft to make sure that everything is accessed. Then your phone will show a notification. Uh, you can have access to your phone not only through Wi-Fi, but you can give it access through your uh, uh, data, cell data. So you can actually have all of this working. If you want to make calls, if you want to make some of the uh, most important features to work and, and like, you know, receiving and sending, uh, making calls, you have to have Bluetooth. You see it here, my Bluetooth settings, Galaxy S25 G is actually linked to my PC. So that will add the calls capability also at the same time. So it's a very, very cool app to use. And uh, definitely, uh, if you have a Samsung Galaxy phone this is a must for windows 10 users if you have just an android phone from other companies you can still use the app but you'll be limited in its um, functionalities it depends on the phone and the version of android that you're using also unfortunately iphone users the uh, reason the, your phone app doesn't really work much with iphones is because of the way that apple limits access to the phone by other uh, third-party uh, apps and this makes it almost impossible for your phone app to really work if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching our videos